Hey, what's up, guys? Uh, Corey here. If you don't know, now you know. Anyways, um, today I'm gonna go over. Uh, can't tell how loud I talk these things on. I'm gonna go over uh, some squats. Um, a lot of people ask me about depth, heavyweight. Uh, you know, should they go? as deep if they go heavy or should they go deeper lighter so on and so forth anyway so i'm going to demonstrate on one of the machines that has the uh the foot placement inclined and uh why i prefer that over your standard back squat and uh and anyways i'm going to show y'all my depth and what i do and how i go through it all right peace Alright guys, so basically you see now um, that was, uh, I don't know, anyways it didn't matter what the weight was, long story short, if you're going fairly heavy, um, that is my usual depth, right? Um, I prefer that machine if you notice, like I said, it's something about the foot placement that puts more puts more of a, uh, an emphasis um, when I go lower on my quads, which is really uh, what I'm working on me personally. Um, anyways, it, as you notice, I always wear the wraps. Usually, man, when I break like four, four and a half, I wrap up just because, uh, I don't know, man, smarter, not harder, right? Plus, I want to be able to walk when I'm like 50, so... Anyways, my opinion, but I would definitely recommend getting you some wraps. Um, they're cheap. You can get them. Hell, I got, I got these online. But anyways, that's the way you want to do those. Now, that's actually the end of my uh, of my sets over there. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and lighten up the weight a little bit and do one more just to show y'all the depth if I have it a little bit lighter. All right. Stay tuned. All right, guys, so there you have it. Um, that's with lighter weight. Um, I tend to go a little bit deeper. Um, ultimately, the main focus for me is making sure that I'm engaging the quads and my hamstrings, my glutes, all that with every single rep. Um, I personally don't like going anywhere past parallel the whole ass to grass thing i don't like doing that if i get heavy or really heavy um just for the simple fact like i said the uh the pressure on my knees um damage that i believe uh it does so anyways com completely preference guys if you're over there like ah oh, core that's bullshit man i go ass to grass and 
I don't care if I'm squatting 700 pounds. Brother, hey, kudos right on. Do what you do. I'm, I'm, hey, wishing you well. But uh, anyways, that's what I do. Check it out, try it out, see if it works for you. Um, if not, stick to what you're doing. But I just thought that I would uh, give y'all a quick tutorial on why I choose to go up a little bit as far as my depth is concerned when I get heavy and why I go that ass to grass um, when I get lighter. So anyways, hope it helped. Hope you learned something. If you like the video, I don't know where the subscribe button is. I think it'll be like over there, maybe, or over here, wherever it is. Like, share, subscribe, and do all the good shit. All right, later.